Hi, I'm Joe Altman, Senior Vice President here at OTC Markets Group. Joining me today is CEO of Maramed, Bob Fireman. Bob, thanks for coming in today and welcome to our Market Center. Thank you for having me uh, and it's my pleasure. As a multi-state <coughs> cannabis operator in the U.S., can you explain the company's dedication to health and wellness? Absolutely. Uh, Maramed has been dedicated to the health and wellness of, of using marijuana and ca cannabis to uh, help people. I mean, the, the industry evolved out of the medical people forcing uh, states to accept this as it gives relief to so many people. Uh, our, t our company is dedicated uh, to running clinics, treating education, and uh, we've just formed a scientific board of advisors of the top uh, cannabis practitioners in New England and uh, we run uh, tests and trials. We're working with some hospitals, we're doing some clinical research on irritable bowel syndrome, and we really believe that what's in these bottles and in these products have to be uh, uh, truly consistent and precise so that people coming uh, know what they're getting and know what it can do for the best effects. We run a uh, clinic for mothers with epileptic children at one of our facilities. And uh, when you see those children stop shaking uh, when they're sitting there with their mothers and their pediatric oncologist, it's quite a sight. Uh, so the people getting relief from anxiety, from nausea, from Parkinson's, from MS, uh, we need to quantify that into peer review medical research so that our medical communities can accept it and use it. That's great. Uh, the company graduated from OTCQB to OTCQX this year. How has that move benefited your shareholders? Well, we, we went to QX because we wanted more visibility. We knew that more institutional players could play in that higher exchange at OTC. And really, we're in a position of uh, consolidation and changing our image. Uh, we, we built our company uh, from the ground up. We're different than other MSOs in that we, we won these licenses, we incubated them, we own and we train them. And our consolidation is not about acquiring these companies, but our consolidation is about putting the businesses that we built under our public company so that that revenue now can be shown. We believe that the revenue from our MSOs, uh, together with the investment we made in hemp with a $30 million investment in Gymkhana, will uh, uh, be reflected in our stock recently. And uh, the QX will give us a better way of raising our capital structure and our market value. Great. Bob, I wish you the best. Thanks for coming in today, and we'll see you soon. Thank you.